What's up guys, Mr. Allen C. Welcome to my gaming room and today we're unboxing something extra special. It's the Logitech G29 racing wheel with feedback. So when you steer, when you turn a hard corner, you rotate that wheel and let go. It's going to wind back the other way. It's just like driving a real car. And we got the Crew 2 on deck, brand new, just came out. We're ready to party. Let's unbox this beautiful G29 racing wheel. Alright guys, so here we are. We got the wheel hooked up. We got the pedals down here. Oh my gosh. And this is amazing. Oh my gosh. It's definitely a two-hand job right now. I'm one hand in it. Oh. oh my god. It's very realistic. Very realistic. Alright, so I got the brake, the foot, pedal, the clutch, and the shifters on the back side of the wheel. Let's go ahead. We will change views here. This is the hood of the car. So this is dope. Oh my god. I really need two hands to drive right now. I'm filming with the GoPro for an unboxing video. Here we go. Hold on. Hold on. I really need two hands to drive right now. This is crazy. I need both hands. Um, maybe I can get an angle like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. So... I found the reverse puddle, it's the middle one. Here we go, so I'm two handing it now. Oh boy. I'm really gonna have to warm up to this. I think I need to turn up the sensitivity a little bit, and then we'll be good to go. Let's go ahead. I'm going to change the view again. Yeah, that's cool. Oh my god. So we collected new reward program content, so that's cool. Oh my god, I really gotta work on the wheel sensitivity so I'm gonna do that now it's pretty cool though guys you see down here we got the uh, got foot pedals down here not a bad unit maybe I'll do a burnout for you if this guy gets out of my way I like that burnout all right hold on Do a little brake stand. Hold on. Oh shit, I wasn't even using the brake. No wonder. I was using the wrong pedal. Alright, now that we know where the brake is, I think we're going to do a better job. Let's roll. Oh mama, oh mama. Still getting used to this. I think I gotta turn the sensitivity down or something. This is crazy. All right, I'm gonna pinpoint this in. You can do a lot with the uh, the options menu, but that is it. That's the G29 racing wheel, guys. Check it out. What up? We got direct banana in the house. I will catch you on the next one, guys. Bye bye. Be sure to subscribe, like the video for more. Wow, what a package. Let's go ahead and we're gonna unbox this right now. And if you love unboxings, this is a good one. If you really love the unboxing process, because there's a second box inside of the first box. G29 Driving Force Racing Wheel. Volante de Course by Logitech. Alright, let me attempt to pull this out. Perfect addition to our gaming setup. Let's get the box rotated. Holy, holy moly! What a beautiful wheel and foot pedals. Look at this bad boy. I'm anxious to get this out of the box. It's got the PlayStation logo. It's got some LEDs. I didn't even know it had those LEDs. Tons of buttons, knobs, 
volume, D-pad, square triangle circle X, R2, R3, lots of stuff on this wheel. And of course the PlayStation Home button. Let's go ahead and unseal this box. This box is beautiful in itself. And let's get this open. Wow, look at all these power wires. That is a lot of power wires. Look at them all. Hey, that's good. We're going to be hooked up. I got the power. What's this right here? This looks exciting. Play seat by Logitech. All right, I'll have to order that one tomorrow. Stay tuned for that unboxing. Looks great. I kind of got a play seat right there, but let's see what else is in here. More instructions. I'm going to place these cords over on the desk here. And got a newly sealed wheel in here. It's warm. It's been sitting outside in the sun. It's really hot over here today. What do we got? Now this is special. So glossy and new, guys. I'll never have this moment again. This is the prime moment when it's brand new. That leather wrap. Oh my gosh, that glossy, glossy seal sticker. Let's go ahead and open this up for the first time ever. It looks amazing. It feels amazing. <clears throat> All right, so I've successfully unwrapped the wheel itself. Looks like it has a USB here. That would plug into your PlayStation 4. All right, so we got the different shifters right here under the wheel. So you can upshift, downshift. We got the clamps right here. You screw these left to get them down, and we are going to mount it right on here. So let's do that now. All right, once mounted, nice and tight, you simply press down and it seals it into place. Next, what we're going to want to do is plug this into the PS4, so I'll do that now. All right, guys, quick basic installation. So, on the bottom of the steering wheel, there's some ports. This cord plugs in here. This is coming from the foot pedals. Uh, this is a power cord. And I think that's it. We're ready to mount it. Um, of course, this one's going to the USB on the PlayStation 4. And these extra cords, there are a ton of extra ones. These are just for people that live in another country that got a different plug-in option. So, we're ready to mount this bad boy and uh, hopefully try it out here. Let's do it. Alright guys, I think it's time to plug it in here. So, I'm plugging it in. Alright guys, it's time to peel that sticker shiny and this thing was rotating on by itself it was crazy uh, I think that's when it got juice to it we're just restarting the PlayStation I accidentally unplugged it wow that is firm that is really firm